नम सुंदरनाथाय तस्म हालास्य वासी चतुष्टि विधा लीला एनाकार भुवस्थरे श्रीमत्सुंदरनाथ से देवी शफ्रलोचना कलिए हृदय नित्यम कदम्ब मनवासी पूत स्वत पूतर तथो यदंगं पय शंकर मौली संगा तत्पात प्रणयापराध पादा तैह पूतम तथो न आनंद ब्रह्म विदा यदेक व्यंग्यालाभेश व्यंग्यलाभेश शत कवीना सहस्रम पुनरबुद परोक्तिदोषस्फुरणे खला इन टेक्स्ट कॉल प्रताप रुद्रीय दिस वॉज रिटन बाय विद्यानाथ इट इज एन अलंकार शास्त्र टेक्स्ट Uh, which explains just like kavya prakasham or uh, uh, in a sahitya darpana this is another text which is a more basic text uh, when compared to kavya prakash or sahitya darpana this is a more basic one and it was written in the 14th century by a kavi called vidyanatha it is uh, a type of literature called yashobhushana the sense the entire text is not uh, he is not taken shlokas from other uh, kavyams he is in fact Uh, created uh, his own uh, um, uh, example shlokas but every shloka is in praise of a king called prataparudra he was a kakatiya uh, uh, vamsha raja and uh, each one of these uh, shlokas that he has taken as examples for say alankaras or uh, dhvani uh, everything is an example is in praise of that king for everything so in that there is uh, uh, one shloka where he says um uh pa kakatiyo na avena ha one minute i was just thinking of that shloka and uh, suddenly it's not uh, coming to my mind mm. parokti aguna varopah <clears throat> parihase pyanauchityam स्वप्ने अन्यवधू कथा शत्रावपि अगुणारोप काकतींद्रो न मर्षति हा ओके सो परिहासे अनौचित्य when you ridicule someone you try to ridicule in such a manner that it, there is no impropriety you, it is appropriate अनौचित्य अनौचित्येन सह तत्र परिहासः कदापि न भवति काकतींद्रः so when when kakatindra does not uh, um, he he cannot tolerate anauchityam even in parihasa and even in his dreams he will not think about uh, going to another uh, person's wife swapne api anyavadhu katha he will not talk about another person's wife and then chatra api aguna aropah shatruhu yadi asti tarhi it is very easy for someone to blame him constantly say you know what he is doing is wrong so it's very easy but even there shatrau api shatruhu yah asti tasmin api aguna aropah dosha aropam esha na karoti so his by describing his qualities he says you know dosha should not be put on even a shatru so here Uh, i was reminded of that shloka when i was uh, uh, thinking about this one anandatuh brahma vidam yadekah see when you when you are thinking of another person even for a shatru for an enemy you should not try to uh, you know uh, find faults in another person or even highlight faults that are there in another person you will have to uh, take in that faults and not show it at all परगुण परमाणु पर्वती कृत्य नित्यम इवन इफ इट इज अ परमाणु लेवल ऑफ अ गुण क्वालिटी गुड क्वालिटी दैट इज प्रेजेंट इन अ पर्सन यू टेक इट एंड ब्लो इट अप इन सच अ मैनर दैट इट लुक्स लाइक अ पर्वत दिस इज बाय भरतहरि ही इज परगुण परमाणु पर्वती कृत्य नित्यम यू शुड कांस्टेंटली थिंक ऑफ एन अदर पर्सन गुड क्वालिटीज एज मैग्निफाइड सो दैट द फॉल्ट्स दैट आर देयर शुड नेवर यू नो अफेक्ट यू एट ऑल you should never highlight those faults right here uh, uh, he says in a different manner because the people who who want there are people always in this world who want to highlight faults they will try to somehow find some fault of the other in another person's 
words. So those people who try to find faults actually experience so much of happiness, much more than what a Kavi writes. Those who understand Brahman, those who are knowers of Brahman, they, they know only of one bliss, which is that Brahman, one happiness, which is one Brahman. Whereas it becomes hundredfold for a poet who attains, uh, uh, every time he attains that suggestion, Yangal Abheshu, every time he, the, the words just click. Vinyasaha yadha, yadha yadha sa vinyasaha, sundarataya praptaha, tarhi vengyartho pi labdhyate. This is the same anando pi jayate. Pratyeka siyapi vengyartha siyalabhe, he gets uh, a happiness when uh, there is a suggestion every time. There is a beautiful suggestion. Now this for a bad person, every time he highlights a fault, he attains 10,000 fold of uh, you know, happiness when he finds a fault in another person. Because he is just waiting for that. A, a good person will never do that. Ape Dikshita says, Gunadosho Budho Grinnan Indukshveda Viveshwaraha Shirasa Shlaghate Purvam Parankanthe Niyachati When you get both, when you see a person and you interact with a person, you look at both the faults and the good qualities. Both are present. You take both. You take a person with all of his qualities. But Shirasa Shlaghate Purvam, you will have to place it on your head and uh, praise it so much, the good, uh, the good qualities that are there in a person. Just as how Shiva takes both the Chandra and the Visham that came out of the Sagara. Both came out of Shira Sagara Mathanam. Chandra is uh, a quality that is very pleasing to everybody. The moon pleases everybody. Whereas Visham is poisonous to everybody. It is poison. He just places it in his uh, throat and does not even let it out for others to suffer. Whereas he takes the Chandra and places it on his head, giving it a, a great sthanam. And by which people also uh, uh, get the good, uh, uh, you know, they also benefit from it. So you should never highlight the faults in another person. Uh, moving on. So, Prajena Padya Brahmataha Pravrtaha Stotum Khalaha Prekshya Kavim Purastad Yena Anyatha Kartu Vidam Yatande Kleshayana Tesham Hi Sayeva Dandaha Now, if they try to find faults, that itself is a fault now and they need to, they need to be punished. If a person tries to find fault in a good Kavi's works, it is very difficult for him to find it. So, the praya saha, saha prayatnam karoti, dosha nam anveshanaya, atyanta prayatnam karoti, kleshancha anubhavati, sa klesha eva tasya danda rupena bhavati. It becomes a punishment for himself because he torture his, tortures himself, troubles himself so much to find faults from a good Kavi's poetry. He, because he tries to find faults in a place where it is not there, he is going to unnecessarily waste his effort and that itself will trouble him and that becomes a punishment for him because he tried to find fault with another person. That's the idea he gives here. So now, Prajena Padya Brahmataha Stotum Pravrittaha Khalaha Initially, a Durjana Khalaha, he gets a poetry in his hand and he thinks it is a Prachina Padyam. Uh, sometimes as uh, uh, poets, uh, we try to write something which is which might click sometimes. Sometimes it really is bad. But then there are times when the uh, poem that we write, it clicks and it comes out very beautifully. And we try to immediately, you know, uh, cheat another person and say, you know, this is somebody else's. Or not even say who this is. And then they will say, where did you get it from? Is this from Kalidasas or is this from Bharatahari? It's a small childish play among poets. That's all. So, Prachina Brahmataha, Prachina Padyam, Prachina hi likhitam Padyam idam iti Brahmataha, Brahmatu. Uh, 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 by that illusion, confusion, Mithyaya, they think that it is a poetry written by Prachina, maybe Kalidasa or someone else. You know? So, Prachina Padya Brahmataha, out of that illusion in their mind, Khalaha, Durjanaha, Stotum Pravrtaha, 
इदं वद्यं तु अतीव सुंदरम अस्ति तत्र शब्द विन्यास हा यू नो द ऑल दीस थिंग्स आर वेरी ब्यूटीफुल द गुणम इज देयर देयर इज एन अलंकार और देयर इज रस देयर सो दे स्टार्ट ऑफ ऑन ट्राइंग टू प्रेज दैट श्लोकम सो प्राचीन पद्य भ्रमतः अंडर द इन्फ्लू इल्यूजन दैट इट इज एन एंशिएंट पोएट्री खलाह स्तोतुं प्रवृत्ताः प्रवृत्ताः बिगिन टू प्रेज तदनंतरम समनंतरमेव स कवि पुरतः आगत्य वदति एतत्तु मम पद्यम इति हि कम्स इन सेस सो तत् पद्य कर्तुः दर्शने द मोमेंट ही सीज दैट दिस पोएट इज अलाइव एंड ही इज प्रेजेंट इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी ही डजंट वांट टू प्रेज नाउ ना इन फ्रंट ऑफ दैट पर्सन यू डोंट लाइक टू प्रेज बिकॉज there he is a khalaha he is a durjana he is a bad person and he does not want to highlight the good qualities of another person if that person is present in front maybe behind his back he will say right so prachina vadya bramatah stotam pravrttah khalaha those uh, bad people under the illusion that it is an ancient poetry or a poetry written by the mahakavis he starts to praise tada पुरतः पुरस्तात् कविं प्रेक्ष्य तत्पद्य कर्तु कर्तारं प्रेक्ष्य सीइंग द राइटर ऑफ दैट यू नो सीइंग द सेम पोएट इन फ्रंट ऑफ देम नो इमीडिएटली दे विल ट्राई टू चेंज हां आदा बात है रे अभी वो यू नो समटाइम्स वी ट्राई टू डू दैट राइट सो ये अन्यथा कर्तुं इदं यतन्ते अन्यथा कर्तुं सगुणम इति यदा प्रशंसितु आरभन्ते तदनन्तरम नन एतद् अन्यथा दोषयुक्तम अस्ति इति कर्तुं कर्तुं इति साधयितुं समर्थयितुं प्रयतन्ते दे ट्राई टू जस्टिफाई दैट दिस इज अदरवाइज अदरवाइज इन द सेंस इट इज फिल्ड विद फॉल्ट्स सो अन्यथा कर्तुं यतन्ते येन क्लेशेन यतन्ते the the effort or the the trouble that they take to uh, uh, change it change their previous opinion anyatha kartum yena kleshena yatante yena kashtena te yatante sa kashtaha kashtameva you know that kleshaha eva becomes a danda tesham tesham khalana तेषां खलानां सयेव सक्लेशः एव येन क्लेशेन दोष गुणयुक्तं पद्यं दोषयुक्तं कर्तुं समर्थयितुं येन क्लेशेन ते प्रयतन्ते विद व्हाट एवर एफर्ट और विद व्हाट एवर ट्रबल दे यूज दे टेक टू जस्टिफाई टू प्रूव दैट इट इज अ a uh, bad poetry that klesha becomes their punishment danda because they cannot find out it if it is a bad poet ku kavi hi iti chet tatra sulabhataya doshana anveshanam kartum shakyam parantu atra uttam kavi hi asti yataha you know we have seen that he has changed his trend of uh, speaking from last class that he is now more on a personalized uh, manner so he is talking about what are all the difficulties that an uttama kavi faces so assuming it is an uttama kavi and he is talking about probably himself in many ways he must have also you know undergone troubles there with the uh, fools around him right so there uh, someone might look at his poetry and say oh this is wonderful subhashitam someone has written and then when nilakanta dikshita comes in front of him they will say no 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 there is this fault there is that fault they will try really hard to find out some fault but that effort itself is so much of a trouble because they cannot find a fault at all and that effort that trouble that they go through becomes a punishment for them for trying to uh, uh, you know find fault in a good poetry प्राचीन पद्य भ्रमत प्रवृत्ता स्तोत खला प्रेक्ष्य कवि पुरस्ता कर्तुदम यतंते क्लेशेन ही सयेव दंडः सयेव दंडः जातः यतः दोष अदर्शना त्र क्लेश शिष्य बिकॉज देर इज नो फॉल्ट इन दट दे ट्रबल दे आर ओनली लेफ्ट विथ देर ट्रबल See, sometimes 
when we you know the anger or finding faults and all that uh, it, it only remains with us it is never translated to the other person because the other person is completely unaware of what is going on and he is confident of himself right here um, the alankara here is called vishama alankara we have seen this alankara before also so anishtasya um, avaptihi ishtartha samudhyamat ishta artha samudhyamat when you are trying to make an effort to get something that is ishtam that is desired when you want a desired result instead of getting the desired result you actually end up having an undesired result anishta avaptihi अत्र दोषरूपम इष्टं दर्शयितुं प्रवृत्ताः खलाः तेषां दण्डः जातः स ते तु दण्डम अनुभवन्ति स तु अनिष्टः एव कस्य तु दण्डम अनुभवितुं यू नो इच्छा भवेत नोबडी वांट्स टू एक्सपीरियंस अ पनिशमेंट हियर राइट सो दैट इज एन अनिष्ट व्हाइल दे वांट टू शो समथिंग इष्टम दे एंड अप रियलाइजिंग अनिष्ट they end up getting something that is undesired so ishta samudhyamat dosha roopam ishtam darshayitum pravrtah te tesham anishta avaptihi eva danda roopa anishta avaptihi jata okay prachina padya bramatah pravrtah khalaah prekshya khala prekshya kavin purasta yenam yatha kartum idam yatante kleshena tesham hi sayeva dandah next one दोष क्वचि कचिदी प्रतीत प्राजाकार प्रवाद सर्व प्रबंध अगतस्तु मे कर्तु कवे जीवनमे दोष द सें ट्रेंड वेर द पोयट इज अलैफ दट दैट इट से दोष हियर स फॉर आलंकारी अलंकार विदा प्रवाद प्रवाद इतने प्रकृष्टवाद परस्पर कथन ए डिस्कशन सी जनरली If you look at the Dosha Prakaranam in uh, uh, many Alankara texts, the way they discuss is, you know, probably there is some one particular Dosha in a particular Kavyam, and uh, uh, they will only highlight that particular Dosha and try to discuss the poetry on hand. They will never go on to a personal attack here. You look at the work that they have done, and do not look at the life that they have led, or you don't look at uh, uh, whether the person is alive or not. Here in today's world, the fact that a kavi is alive itself is a dosha because he is a nuthana kavi. Saha mrutas chete, saha he is not in front of us. so it's okay we can probably highlight one or two doshas in him and say oh it's okay eko hi dosha guna sannivade nimajjati indo kirane shivanka so one dosham will just completely go away in a set of gunas and uh, alankarik alankarikas probably discuss in this manner but durjana sarva prabandha anugataha doshah for them a dosha a flaw that is present in all works is that the poet is alive so i'm sure this is a very very personal experience for uh, uh, nilakanta dikshita where you know uh, someone might have his students might have read his poetry and then another person might have said oh he is reading you know this is wonderful but then the moment they say that it is my guru and points out that he is alive and then immediately they will try to find faults that is that must have happened otherwise nilakanta dikshita wouldn't have written so many shlokas about this so kaschit doshah कोपि अपगुण देर इज देर इज सम फॉल्ट क्वचि इन सम प्लेस कतीत प्रतीत अभिव्यक्त अथवा ज्ञात महाकवी पद्यु यापि कचन एक दोष अथवा द्वित्रा दोषा जाता ज्ञाता प्रॉब्ली प्राचा आलंकार अलंकार विदा अलंकार अलंकार विदी जानती सो काव्यशास्त्र ये जानते काव्यशास्त्र आलंकारिका प्रवाद प्रवाद इतर आर् मेनी मीनिंग फॉर प्रवाद इफ यू लुक एट द डिक्शनरी यू फाइंड द मीनिंग ऑफ रूमर आलो फॉर प्रवाद हियर यू वॉन्ट टेक इट एज रूमर वी विल टेक इट एज परस्पर कथन कॉन्वर्जेशन प्रवाद प्रकृष्ट वाद यू कैन टेक इट एज डिस्कशन आलो देर देर कैन बी अ ग्रेट आर्ग्युमेंट अबउट वन पर्टिक्युर्शन इन सम वन काव्य 
there have also been people who have written theses on apaniya prayogas in ramayana apaniya prayogas in kalidasa all these are there uh, faults in people have even uh, got a degree based on finding faults in others poetry that's, that's also there uh, but here in alankara shastra if you take up kavi prakashan or uh, uh, sahitya darpana in the dosha prakaranam they will take up one particular shloka of a uh, uh, kavi he must have written 22 sargas some 2000 and odd shlokas there or maybe even more they will probably they would have highlighted very very few you know in uh, uh, I, I, whatever i have seen of the dosha prakaranam in kavi prakasham and sahitya darpana from kalidasa's shlokas he has written so many kavyams and natakams they have only taken two or three examples of kalidasa and maybe two of bharavi i have not seen any shloka of maishadham or uh, you know shishupala vadha uh, for that why do they pick out these shlokas just to say that try to avoid such doshas it is not to highlight and say that these mahakavis are always writing with dosha tathana that is just an exaggeration this is just to highlight and try to avoid certain faults that's all so that is the way an alankarika poetics experts talk amongst themselves just to highlight a flaw somewhere kashchit dosha ha kopi dosha ha dosha ullekhane Uh, you know there is a, they, they only find out certain uh, 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 one particular dosha kaschit dosha kwachit somewhere pratita gnata ra nutana kavaya api evam na kuryu iti te manyante tatha that is why they do this dosha ullikya parasparam alapanti it's just a conversation among them right so alankara vidam pravadaha but what about this khalaha i think the poet says manye kim manye te sa sarva prabandha anugataha doshaha tu the fault that is uh, pervading all works is kavehe kartuhu kavehe yaha tat padya karta tat prabandha karta asti tadrisha kavehe jeevanam eva saha praniti shwasiti tavareva dosha that alone is the dosha and so they will try to find faults dosha kvachit kaschit i think you can say vyatreka alankara where the the drishti of an alankarika and the drishti of a khala is different a durjana is very different he shows the difference but there is no comparison here as such so you can't call it as an alankara he is just showing the uh, difference between them alankarikanam durjananam cha dosha ullake ullekhane kidrishah bhedah asti teva sah vadati na tu tatra vyatireka alankaram vaktum shakyate okay so doshah kwachit kaschit iti pratitah prajam alankara vidam pravadaha sarva prabandha anugatastu manye kartuhu kavehe jeevaname dosha मुदैव वाक्यु पदेश अधीत मुदैव दीर्घम कविता पथे हवश्यक यकिल पाण आवर्जन तीत गेट पॉप्युरीटी वैल दे आर अलाइव सो समोट ओके दे मे बी एक्सेप्टेड अमंग स्कॉलर्स बट सात प्राय तव्या न it can happen right so uh, uh, that could have been the case with nilakanta dikshita also so he says i have unnecessarily wasted my time in studying mimamsa vyakaranam tarkam kavita you know even even uh, uh, kavya shastram alankara shastram and anya maha kavinam padyani api vrithaiva mudhaiva mudha is in main अननेसेसरी व्यर्थ यूजलेस सो वाक्यु मुदैव अधीत वाक्यु विषय वाट एवर इज प्रेसेंट इन वाक्य वाक्यम हियर इंडिकेट मीमांसा शास्त्र वेर द कनेक्शन ऑफ पद समूह वाक्य ओके सो पदा समूह ए कांबिनेशन ऑफ ए ग्रूप ऑफ वर्ड्स इज कॉल वाक्य 
सो पद समूहा अवगमनाय प्रवृत्त शास्त्र प्रवृत्त मीमसा शास्त्र सो दुवे यू हाव व्याकरण शास्त्र आलो बट व्याकरण शास्त्र लुक द एंटरिटी ऑफ सिद्धांत कौमुदी और इवन अष्टाध्याय मोर मोर टाइम इज स्पेन्ट ऑन पदा व्युत्पत्ति सो वेन यू से पदेशु अधीत यू वुड से पद व्युत्पत्ति बोधयत्सु व्याकरण शास्त्रु एंड वाक्यम मीमसा स्टार्ट फ्रम द बिगिंग टू टेल यू हाउ यू हेव टू अंडर्स्टैंड सेंटेसे whether it is you how you classify those sentences is it a vidhi vakyam it is an is it a nisheda vakyam what is what gains more pramanam over what uh, uh, that sort of an analysis because it has it is a shastram that has come about to explain the sentences that are there in the vedas so it is a vakya shastra mimamsa to mimamsa shastreshu api apedikshita was also a great uh, mimamsaka so coming in that line of scholars nilakanta dikshita is also a great mimamsaka but uh, what he has written is more of he had any leaning towards kavyam i guess he is not uh, has written shaiva siddhanta text but not much of uh, mimamsa text i'm not sure uh, maybe there are and we don't know about it today right so vakyeshu padeshu mudhaiva adhitam adhyayanam kritam वाक्यु मीमसा शास्त्रु पदेश व्याकरण शास्त्रु मुदैव अधीत इन वेन ई हेव अनेसेसरली स्टडीड मीमसा शास्त्र एंड व्याकरण शास्त्र नॉट ओनली दैट काव्य शास्त्र अभ्यास मुदैव कथम दीर्घ मुदैव अभ्यास कविता पथे कविताया पथि मगे in the path of poetry also dirgha dirgha kalam yavad for a long time i have spent uh, too much time in this path of poetry uh, mudhaiva mudhaiva unnecessarily again yat kila pamaranam avashyakam why does he say this see what is necessary for pamara pamara is a prakrita pratibha rahitanam ध्वनि ध्वनि आवश्यक समथिंग filled with yamaka filled with the, you know um, uh, jalam But you read a shloka this way it means something if you read a shloka the other way it means something these are all only vak jalam it is only shabdalankara it is it does not go beyond the words into the rasa or the atma of kavya it is only a, a quick two minute attraction that's all you cannot A, 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 a study of kavya if you want to after 10 years or 20 years later if you want to take up a kavya and read you would rather read uh, kalidasa's poetry or an uttaram charitam uh, uh, rather than look at these shabdalankara shlokas that is what is time tested uh, things right so uh, um, he has not he says i have not found a way to study the things that is akarshanam avarjanam is akarshanam so yat kila pamaranam prakrita jananam krite avashyakam uchitam avarjanam avashyakam is necessary or you can say essential attraction or an appropriate attraction for them avarjanam kimapi na adhitam kimapi shastram na padhitam maya iti kavihi vadati see it's actually a veiled uh, uh, you know phrase of himself Uh, it's like a stuti for himself he is saying dikshitendra tu swasya kavyam sahridaya hridaya ahladi asti natu pamara jananam krite shabda alankara yuktam iti he he says mine is only targeted towards the kanashiyas and rasagnya 
it is not targeted toward towards normal people who can only look at the shabdalankaras who don't know much about kavya mudhaiva vakyeshu padeshu adhitam mudhaiva dirgam kavita padhepi avashyakam yatkila pamaranam avarjanam tat na kimapi adhitam so you can take it as uh, that dikshitendra um, uh, dikshitendra nam kavyani ಸಹೃದಯೃದಯಮಾಹ್ಲಾದಯಂತಿಸರ್ಗತೋಗುಣಿಗುಂಫಂ ಸಮರ್ಥಯಂತೆ ಸಗುಣಂ ಬಲಾಧ್ಯೇ ತೇ ಕಂಚುಲಿ ಸನ್ನಹನ ಉನ್ನತೇನ ಲಂಬಸ್ತನೇನ ಮುದಂ ಲಭಂತೆ ಸೊ ದಿ ಐಡಿಯಾ ಹಿಯರ್ ಇಸ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಹೂ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಮೆನಿ ಓಕೆ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಮೆನಿ ಶ್ಲೋಕಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ವಿಚ್ ಡೂ ನಾಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಎನಿ ಗುಣ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ ಮಾಧುರ್ಯಾದಿ ಗುಣ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಆಸ್ ದ ಟೆಕ್ನಿಕಲ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಗುಣ which is madhuryam prasadam ojah these are the three gunas that are present uh, uh, that have been defined by alankarikas uh, and in any poet ukti gumpham ukti ukti nam gumphah grathanam gumphanam is um, uh, uh, making a garland you know todukkaradam bo tamil right malai mala todukkaradu like with the flowers you just attach it it has a very specific way of connecting in such a manner that it does not come out loose right so gumphanam ityukte padyam is like that the padyam is actually the words are arranged in such a manner that it is like a mala a garland where you cannot remove one word and substitute it with another word or you cannot uh, uh, you know it is not loose it should be tight and uh, the way you say the shloka also you will understand it once you start un- uh, reading the dosha prakaranam where if i it is not connected at all if the words are not connected then it is very loose so mala gumphanam eva grathanam eva tatra uktinam gumphah abhi uh, avashyakah eva see so here if you if you there is a beauty to arranging a garland also there should be a, a, a symmetry to it there should be a color combination to it if you look at all the malas that are hanging in a um, we have one street in paris corner for pukarantare you know there will be lovely garlands which are hanging there are many places where there are streets with the garland uh, uh, makers there so if you look at it the more uh, 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 attention they give to the uh, uh, arrangement of those uh, flowers the more beautiful it is you will know that and there should be a creativity in the sort of arrangement that they do with the flowers ತಾದೃಶ ಗುಣಯುಕ್ತ ಭವಿತವ್ಯ ಅತ್ರ ಪದ್ಯ ಅಿ ರೈಟ್ ಗ್ರೂಪ್ ದ್ಲೋಕ ಶುಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸಚ್ ಅನ್ ಅರೇಂಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಷನ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಎ ಗುಣ ಬಟ್ ಸಮ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ದೇ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ದೇ ಲುಕ್ ಎಟ್ ಅ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಪದ್ಯ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಕವಿ ಹೂ ಹೂಮ್ ದೇ ಲೈಕ್ ವೆರಿ ಮಚ್ or they want to prop up a kavi who uh, you know who is actually a bad kavi but then they are supporting this kavi so that they will also get money in the process so that can also happen so nisargatah nirgunam ukti gumpham or it can also be a person uh, who does not have that pratibha and he is trying to praise a bad kavi so ku kavi prashamsa paraha kaschana durjanah ಆಗ್ರಹೇಣ ಬಲಾತ್ ಹಠಾತ್ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಕಾವ್ಯ ಸಗುಣ ಕರ್ತು ಸಮರ್ಥಯತಿ ಹಿ ಟ್ರೈಸ್ ಯತತೆ ಸೊ ನಿಸರ್ಗತ ಸ್ವಭಾವತ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಉಕ್ತಿ ಬಂಧಂ ಉಕ್ತಿ ಗುಂಫಂ ಸೊ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಗುಣರಹಿತ ಉಕ್ತಿ ಗುಂಫಂ ಉಕ್ತಿ ವಾಕ್ಯ ಗುಂಫಂ ಗ್ರಥನ that the the uh, arrangement of expressions which is meritless which has no guna without any quality tadrishan gumpham grathanam arrangement balat sagunam samarthayante they try to uh, um, they, they try to justify that it has qualities 
Now, he, the Kavi poet compares this to a common example of how, you know, generally um, uh, a, a lady who has, you know, it is, it is naturally accepted that one who is in the youth and with the firm bosoms, uh, a chest, that is, they are supposed to be very beautiful uh, women. And he says, these are people, those people who try to, you know, bring, think, justify that this has gunam, they attain happiness, mudam labhante, uh, even with a person who has lambastana, who has droopy uh, bosoms, but they are made firm, they are tied with a uh, choli. Kanchuli, sannahana, unnatena, unnatena, they are made firm or tall, looking to be firm and not droopy. Kanchuli, uh, sannahanena, by kanchuli baddhena, cholika baddhena, bandhena, unnati kritam sanamapi, drishtva te mudam prapnuvanti. So this is a type of uh, alankara called nidarshana alankara where you are trying to compare two things that are not uh, possible. It's called asambhavat vastu sambandha. You are doing an aikya aropam using yat and tat. Ye sagunam samarthayante te lambastane nabi mudam prapnamanti. Even though they look at a person who is not in their youth, they still feel happy about that person. So it is a natural thing that a youth looks at a young lady and only feels happy about it. And they are not attracted towards an older lady. So that is the idea which he takes. That is not possible. So in the same way, it is not possible to uh, uh, nirgunam kavyam Sagunam kartum na pariyate. He tries to uh, uh, do a superimposition about these two things which are not possible. So, nirguna utti grathanasya saguna samarthanam api na shakyate. Tatha kanchuli, kanchuli ityukte cholika, cholika sannahanam bandha, bandhena unnati kritam stanam api sanena mudam prapnotum na shaknoti. Okay, santosham prapnotum na shaknoti. Hence, he compares these to Vakyam and it is called Nidarshana Alankara where Vakyartha Yoho, Sadrisha Yoho. There are two Vakyams. The first Vakyam is your Upameya Vakyam and the second Vakyam is the Upamana Vakyam. You are trying to say that these two are the same. Even though there is no comparison here, uh, you are using two sentences to say that these two are the same. Okay. So, Nisargataha uh, Nirguna Mukti Gumpam Samarthayante Sagunam Balat Ye Te Kanchuli Sannahana Unnatena Lambastanena Bi Mudam Labhante. And the next shloka Panditya Lobo Yadi Pamarana Kamam Vihim Santu Kalas Trishashtim Kaste Abaradaha Kavite Grihitam Kim Kaste Abaradaha Grihitaha uh, Kimasti Te Kinchana Purva Vaira. There are 64 colors, the, uh, you know, and uh, there are 64 arts. And Kavita, Kavya Karanam is one of them. Anyatamam Asti. Chatushti Kalasu, Kavya Karanam Abhi Ekam Asti. Now, Panditya Lobhaha Yadi Pamarana. Fools want to, more than fools, you can take it as Prakrita Janaha. Samanya Janana Ankrate, Yesham Samanya Janana Yadi Icha Vartate, Kidrishi Icha, Panditya Icha. Pandita Se Bhavaha Panditya. Panda itself means Buddhi. And Panda Se Asti Iti Panditaha. Pandita Se Bhavaha Panditya Itute Buddhi. One who wants to get that Panditya skill. There are many skills in this world. 64 skills are given. Why do they have to come and uh, uh, you know, torture this Kavita? They don't need to even try to achieve this skill. There are so many other skills. Let them go and torture the other 63 arts. Panditya Lobhaha Yadi Pamaranam. Pamaranam Pratibha Rahitanam Jananam Samanya Jananam. Those who are without any creativity. If they have a greed for skill, Panditya Lobhaha Yadi Asti Lipsa Labdhun Icha. If they have a greed to attain some skill or the other, Kamam, Kamam Ityukti Swachandam, Sveshtam, Svechaya, Svechaya Gatva 
चतुर सॉरी त्रिषष्टिम कला हा विहीन संतु लेट देम टॉर्चर मे देम टॉर्चर द अदर 63 आर्ट्स नॉट द वन आर्ट दैट इज यू नो नीड्स ए सटिलिटी let them not go and try uh, this kavita let them go and torture other arts because this needs an extra intelligent for you to write a poetry it's not an easy job you know you have uh, so many things to look for kwa shabda ha kwa artha ha kwa guna ha kwa rita ya ha we saw that in the earlier shloka right uh, so there are so many aspects to look at in a poetry in trying to connect the poetry there are other arts like you know even uh, learning to uh, string a garland is one of the uh, art painting is one of the art even painting is difficult it's not an easy job but then you know uh, nilakanta dikshita being a poet himself he says don't come to my area why don't you all go somewhere else you know pavarana Common for common people, यदि पांडित्य लोभ हा वर्तते, if you all have agreed for attaining some sort of skill, त्रिशष्टिम कला हा कामं विहिंसंतु, विहिंसंतु अर्धयंतु टॉर्चर, ना गो एंड ट्रबल, the the sixty three arts, त्रिशष्टिम, you can't change this, see त्रिशष्टि ही is the प्रथमा, द्वितीय या कर्मपदम अत्र त्रिशष्टिम Kalaha iti bahu vachanam. So, three shashti can never, there is no three shashta yaha or shashti in a, uh, that sort of a change never happens for this. So, three shashti in kalaha. Shatam kalaha. In, if you take hundred arts, something like that. Those numbers just stay as, uh, as such. I think after uh, uh, 20, the numbers just stay like that. Until I think uh, 19, you can have uh, um, Uh, uh, different vibhakti uh, 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 for them yeah so uh, not different vibhakti sorry i think from three you yeah, yeah. so eka ekasya sorry how did i forget this ekaha eka ekam is only in eka vachanam do will be in vivachanam from three it should be in uh, uh, bahu vachanam But then some uh, numbers, I think from twenty or something like that, you will have only in this whatever way they are declined. So three shastin kala ha, we him santu. Let them go and torture the other sixty three kalas. Hey Kavite, now he addresses his uh, devata, Kavita devata. So he calls uh, upon uh, Kavita who oh, poetry. Kaste aparada ha, grihi ta ha. What fault did you do? is there any earlier enmity that these people come to you and give you so much of trouble did you do anything to them kaha te aparadha krutaha anyeshu anyeshu pamareshu ye pamara janaha pandityam kavitayam pandityam labdhum yatante te te teshu tvaya ke kim kaha aparadha krutaha So he says, "What is the fault, sin that you have committed towards those people who are trying to torture you, or is there any unknown previous enmity that he is coming and troubling you like this?" So these are the if if someone is troubling us, if someone is torturing us, there are two things that we will ask them. Na enna panne. That's that's a very common thing. What did I do for me to deserve this? Right? Or there is some inexplicable. अदृष्टवशा कि पूर्व विरोध प्राय कश्चन पूर्व वैर किंचन पूर्व वैर अस्त वास्किंग पोएट्री सो ओ पोएट्री कवि कहा ते अपराधा गृहीता हा व्हाट सिन हैव यू कमिटेड कीमा भी किंचना पूर्व वैरम अस्तिकिं दे तबा फॉर यू इज देर एनी अदर प्रीवियस एनी मिटी विद यू दैट दे शेयर पांडित्य लोभ यदि पामरा आना कामं भीम संतु कला हा त्रिशेष्टिं कस्ते अपराधा कविते गृहीता हा कि मस्तिते किंचना पूर्व वैरम any uh, questions i'll stop with this uh
ओके यस नमस्ते मैम नमस्ते इन दैट दंडहा नो दैट दन दंडहा ऑफ द आई थिंक फर्स्ट वर्स आल्सो यस it is the ichha bhangam that they are experiencing is the danda for their duskriti or dush pravritti ichha bhangam yes. not is... only ichha bhangam it is also the trouble that they are going through you know the the the, the torture that they go through the mind there, there is a lot of trouble they, that they go through to find out faults which is not yes. at all there so ichha yeah. bhangastu phalam That ah. is the end result. The process that they grow go through okay. to try to find out doshas. That itself is a torture here. Okay, okay. And mm. ultimately, that also. And yes, it's a problem. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Yeah. But in case they get one mistake in their hard work, suppose ah. they find out, they will be. It's like getting a lottery yeah. for them. It is. Ah, that is the sahasram arbudamva santosha. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. like that earlier, sir. Yeah. then uh, the other one that muthaihi vakyeshu padeshwarin and that was yeah. uh, mm. the second line i think he, uh, he again wants to talk about like he wants to please only the higher class of sagradayas yes. not the common people that's why yes. you you uh, you told me i understood that but i right. uh, uh, thought actually he is in utter uh, despair that he is not a uh, popular uh, among public that's what i felt immediately but generally he is not that sort of a person you know he is he, if you look at his other works like kalivadamanam or anything he is more inclined to you know uh, uh, ridicule other people he is not uh -huh. <laughs> so he doesn't want the approval of other people okay. all he says is See, it is very difficult to please these people. That's all. Ah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Because I have not studied anything which is uh, useful for them. Okay. The That's last one, Kastya ah. Baradha, that uh, he is expressing his unhappiness towards the, those Dushkavis, not ah. directly, uh, but yeah. expressing it through the Kavita Devada. Yes. So there yes, must yes. be some aranga, something will be there. No, it's not directly. It's through. But the Vengam is he only is his unhappiness only is shown actually there. But through uh, Devi, Kavita Devi. No, so who Kavi Nam? Uh, you can say it is a Vastu Dhvani where he says who Kavi Nam Ninda Kriyate Atraidi. Yeah, but it's not. That's what the beauty there is. it's not he is not directly saying but he is saying it on devada how are you i mean what mistake have you done it's something like a something stuti like, ninda uh, or something uh, like that maybe it's hmm. like that is it has more effect, ninda. Uh, more effect on that uh, his feeling when it is through Uh, somebody, I mean the devil. Uh, uh, yeah, maybe I'll I'll think about it and see. Maybe by next class I'll try to say something. Uh, maybe nice Vyaja Stuti or Vyaja Ninda uh, can come uh, in this and try to find out another car. Yeah, Let's another see. way of expressing his uh, that unhappiness. That's it. That's all. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, thank you. See, that, uh, yeah. No, the, no. The, the generally for Neela and Dikshita, he is not bothered by normal people. He has written only mm -hmm. for you know Sahitya Kr. ஆஹ்லாதம்ஸ்லோக்கா <laughs> i would term it as legitimate pride <laughs> uh, it may be legitimate but uh, the way you know he expresses i feel yeah. that it it is arrogance actually mm. it, maybe, uh, maybe see the thing mistaken. is uh, he you should also think about the circumstance in which he was writing his poetry and the circumstance what he has uh, seen in the rajya sabha that mm -hmm. must have prompted him to write so much about it Uh, maybe, maybe I uh, understand. Yeah, especially yeah. when the, the last one, that is the sixty-eighth shloka, yeah, is saying yeah. that you know the pamaranam, the common people should never come near uh, poetry. Mm. Pamaranam more you know, than is, common people, more than common people take it as pratibha rahitana. 
येषां तु प्रतिभा नास्ति तेषां कृते एव तेषा तान उद्देश्य इव अत्र any yeah, unlearned uh, person can become a learned person by definitely effort and hmm. if he have, i mean supposing a person who does not have this talent or whatever uh, aptitude which is necessary for uh, uh, writing appreciating poetry. poetry not appreciating so, poetry he is talking about writing poetry see hmm. appreciating poetry just one uh, this thing for appreciating poetry is a different uh, category which you can learn but writing poetry is something different tatra mm-hmm. to you need uh, saraswati anugraha mm mm-hmm. mm-hmm. otherwise it is not difficult if you just study vyakarana shastram and you try to write a poetry it's very difficult that yeah. i agree with you but mm-hmm. now, now do you mean to say that he is addressing those people who are trying yeah. to write poetry or who are mm-hmm. trying to appreciate poetry not appreciate poetry he is only trying to talk about people who are trying to accomplish that skill of writing poetry not appreciating okay. poetry because okay. it is only kavya kavanam eva tatra kala kavya karanam eva kala na tu kavya appreciation of poetry is not kala samasya purnam ityadikam to it is a kavya karanam eva kala okay 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 if that is so then you know i think he he is he is yeah. <laughs> he is crazy torture also. too much yeah, but i mean i am a pa- i am a palmer only i don't have any knowledge yeah. or the talent or anything uh-huh. but uh, i feel that you know um, i can appreciate a good poetry appreciate so is different it, definitely then mm-hmm. more people can appreciate poetry sadhudaya you need to be in the same wave wavelength and frequency of the poet then you can appreciate his poetry it's very easy mm-hmm. and you need to have those if you have the parameters in your hand to appreciate poetry it's quite possible i mean with the guidance you can <laughs> <laughs> but still i feel that you know a little bit of uh, vinayam Uh, would have been you know better i felt i mean he is one the ekachaka vinayam you should you should see his uh, ananda sagrastanam uh, then you will understand the uh, uh, greatness of this poet oh uh, see this is not it's uh, he is trying to give both sides it's not an arrogant uh, stature it's more out of you know if you look at uh, bhartrahari's uh, neeti shatakam the f- first uh, shloka is mangala shlokam the next one is बोधारह मत्सरग्रस्ता प्रभव स्मय दूषिता अबोध उपहता जीर्णमंगे सुभाषित बोधारह मत्सरग्रस्ता दोज हू नो आर ऑल जेलस पीपल हू आर इंटेलिजेंट आर जेलस प्रभव स्मय दूषिता किंग्स आर आरगेंट स्मय दूषिता अबोध उपहता वाट अबउट द रेस्ट ऑफ द पीपल दे आर ऑल इग्नोरेंट so whatever subhashitam i'm saying jirna mange subhashitam it is just going to be digested in myself that is arrogance there <laughs> you know you're saying there is no other sahridaya there to appreciate your work mm-hmm. but there is a background there also because i has so, i mean the the, the, in, uh, the situation or the time or the place yeah. where, where you know they came up with uh, such poetry or yeah. such words probably there, you know it uh, they they were responsible for uh, such harsh words yeah. probably <laughs> <laughs> yeah inniki we are trying to understand it uh, uh, asynchronous you know we are okay. we are not in that time frame we are not in that right. situation right. and right. we are trying to look at it from outside from and our pass a judgment on it yes yes, yes. that's what that it is yeah <laughs> okay thank you <laughs> no problem all right thank you ah um you were explaining about the flowers that are used in a garland the different mm-hmm. types uh, i was just thinking the most fragrant flowers that will be the attractive uh, garland right instead of having colorful because yeah. uh, the fragrant is one which is more attractive than the color. very true so gandha here can mean the rasa which is which yeah. is not seen uh, outside in the f- color in the garland in the flower but it is to be experienced later <laughs> correct that's a very nice uh, connection yeah because i was just thinking about uh, sita wearing that perfume 
Okay, I think that's it. Namaste. We'll meet uh, next week.